guys, what's up? It's Haley. Welcome back to my channel. Now, this is gonna be a pretty short little video today. I just like saw these little Taco Bell chips at 7 Eleven, and I was like, what the fuck is that? I have to try that. And obviously, I want to do it on camera. So, that's what we're doing today. We all know that I am obsessed and addicted to Taco Bell. Hello, that's like where I go for dinner every night. Um, but not right now because I am trying to be a little skinny, but. You know, we're just gonna go back to our old winter ways for a moment and reminisce and try these Taco Bell chips. So let's get into it. Of course, the number one thing that I had to check was to make sure that they were vegan and obviously they were, so we're here, thank God. Don't you ever try to tell me that being vegan is hard because look at my channel. So, okay, so they came in this little black bag. I felt like such a little mobster leaving 7-Eleven. But little did everyone know, I just had my little chips. Um, I'm going to be completely honest. I'm a messy ass bitch. And my car has been a mess for like two months because I've been working a ton. So these are a little busted and broken. <laughs> but the flavor is still going to be there. And that's what I'm here for today. So I got all of the flavors that they had. They had mild, fire, and Diablo. I already know Diablo is going to be my favorite because keep it spicy, but we're going to try all three. Of course, I have my little annoyance with me, <laughs> and he's going to test them out too. Maybe the mild if it's not too spicy. And obviously, I have my Diet Coke with me as a palate cleanser just to be sure, you know, they all get a fair equal shot. So I'm going to rate them all on a scale of one to five, and we'll see what's the winner. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and start with number one. It's gonna be the mild. And these have the little sayings on the front, just like the little Taco Bell hot sauce. Oh, I just had a brilliant idea, hold on. Okay, so I just went and looked at my little hot sauce collection and I don't have any mild because I don't get mild. And I don't have any Diablo because I could literally drink that like it's water, but I do have some hot and some fire like OG Taco Bell sauces. So I'm gonna try to like put these on the chips and see if it makes it any better. I'm a genius. So we're gonna start with the mild. Um, they have the little sayings on them like they do in the little packets, which I think was a very cute touch. This one said, you made my day. And that goes out to all of you. You guys made my day, thanks for watching. Let's open this bitch up. Oh yeah. Okay, they're not even that smushed. I'm like so proud of myself. I didn't even have to admit that like my car's a mess because they look delicious. And these literally look like Doritos. Oh my God, I haven't had a Dorito in 10 years. So let's see if it's anything like that. Oh my God. Goodbye to any castings that I have for the rest of the week because That is so, so good. They're like, they literally look like Doritos. Honestly, they probably like this. Tino just snatched one. Tino! This is honestly probably a collab with Dorito because these literally look like Doritos and they taste like what I remember a Dorito to taste like. These have no spice. And like I get that these are supposed to be the mild, but like, come on. They just taste like tomato. So, hopefully the other ones have a little bit more of a kick because that's what I'm here for. So, I would rate them mild on a scale of one to five, probably like a two. Like, they're bomb, but like, they need some spice in their life. And let's move on to the fire. This is gonna be a little bit better. I can already tell, like, I'm so excited to try this. And the thing on the label says challenge accepted. Dun, dun, dun. Ooh, these are like red, red. <gasps> Honestly, I can't even imagine the amount of like red dye, like food dyes that are in here. <laughs> I honestly should, probably shouldn't be consuming them, but. Cool. So, I'll, okay, let's try this. This one tastes a little bit better. But, like, I don't know why they're trying to call them fire because they're not spicy. But 
but they're super flavorful. Okay, let's go ahead and like try to put some hot sauce on it to make it a little bit spicier. Got the fire sauce with the fire chips. I really wanna see like the flavor comparison to see if these like taste the same. So I'm gonna take the chip and put a little sauce on it. Oh my God, lost in the sauce. And we're gonna try this. It's literally the same flavor. Like spot on, literally the same flavor. That's weird. That's honestly weird how they made like a sauce and a chip taste exactly the same. Like I couldn't tell where the sauce began and the chip ended. Wow. But I would still have it without the sauce because like the sauce is kind of cold and like this out of five i would say a four cheers to you guys let's do another little palette cleanser and we're gonna move on to the last chip diablo this one says you thought you were hot literally me with makeup to me without makeup you thought you were hot <laughs> So uh, this one is supposed to be the spiciest. Hopefully it actually is. I'm almost there. <laughs> Approximately 10 hours later. Yes, okay, we got it. So these are literally black. Terrifying, these are black chips. And you can see all this like spice on them. And it's like orange. Let's honestly, let's read the ingredients to see how much dye is actually in this. Coating corn matzo flour, sunflower, safflower, and pork and oatmeal seasoning. Maltodextrin, spices, unaligned yeast extract, salt, sugar, garlic powder, onion powder, extractors of paprika and turmeric for color, citric acid, natural flavors, disodium and sonite, disodium guan white. Fruit and vegetable juice for color. Let's give this one a try. Oh my god, I wish I had some guacamole right now. Mm, this one's good. This is a five out of five. They're not like as spicy as like a talkie, but the flavor. She is here and she's proud. This turned into a mukbang real fast. You heard it here first. These are the new Taco Bell chips at 7-Eleven. Let me know if you guys have given them a try. And if you have, leave a comment. Let me know which one is your favorite. And if not, leave a comment and let me know what sauce you normally get at Taco Bell. I normally get Diablo. I used to get Verde before they got rid of it. I'm still not over that. Honestly, fuck you Taco Bell for that. It's so unfair. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to subscribe to my channel and give it a thumbs up. Hey guys, Future Haley here editing. Just wanted to know why the hell my thumb is so small. Literally, huh? Thumbs up, leave that comment, follow me on Instagram, Darling Haley. Glad you guys enjoyed getting fat with me because God knows I had a blast. So I'll see you guys next time. Let me know what other foods you want me to try because I'll try them. And I hope you guys have a great day. Bye, guys. I get right.